Only on 10 News. It's very disturbing. Um, it, it's just, it, it makes you wonder uh, what else are they capable of. A stranger creeping through an upscale neighborhood trying to get into cars, as you see here. 10 News reporter Michael Chen found out that neighbors say this is a symptom of a bigger problem and they are fed up. As a habit, every morning this homeowner checks his surveillance video, while the other morning, a huge surprise in this driveway. Along Brook Court. It's a great neighborhood, it's quiet. In an upscale part of La Mesa. We know everybody in the neighborhood. Someone who doesn't look familiar. That's such a bold thing to do. Looking very comfortable in this neighborhood. He was very calm about it, he wasn't in a hurry. Wednesday, 2.30 in the morning. A figure in a hoodie makes a beeline for Kanan El Qadi's SUV. And he... He basically took a look inside and then attempted to open the door. Here's what the video captured. You can see the person walk up to the driver door. It's, it's, it's shocking. And peer inside before trying the handle. It's locked. The figure then moves to a friend's car parked in the same driveway. It's also locked. The person then saunters off. I don't want to say I felt violated, but uh, it, it, you know, it does. You do go through a bunch of emotions. He's hardly alone on the app next door. Other neighbors living blocks away reported someone broke into their cars. They woke up in the morning and saw that their cars had been ransacked. Those neighbors still trying to figure out what, if anything, was taken. Crimes in the immediate neighborhood are rare, but according to CrimeMapping.com, within a mile radius, dozens of crimes in the past month, including car thefts, break-ins, and burglaries. al Qadi hoping his video will create more awareness. One person in the neighborhood can't protect everybody, but if as a collective we're, we're, we're keeping an eye out for these things, then it's, it'll make everybody else much safer. Michael Chen, 10 News.